Yeah, that's the main thing. Oh, g'day. Box 5 This is... Yeah, this is the um, double sideband suppressed carrier tramping radio. You can get an idea of the size there. Whole idea is to fit inside a sandwich container that I can take away tramping with me. So simply we got down here a Arduino Mini. Um, and that's driving the small OLED display as well as the SI5351. 5351 is sending a um, frequency through to the SBL1. The way I've got the software set up, it's essentially directly 2 to 30 megs at this stage, but um, the output filters, which I'll talk about later, is tuned for 80, 40, and 20 meters. So it's mainly an 80, 40, 20 meter um, transceiver. Uh, RF, RF comes in through here, through the broadband uh, filter, just knock off the, uh, the high power broad, uh, broadcast AM stations through a single stage uh, 2N3904 RF amplifier into the SBL1. Output the SBL1, this is grey wire here, runs through to the AF strip. First part is a 3904 again, then into an LM317, which has enough drive to uh, run the speaker. Um, when I'm out tramping, I, I take a um, headset with me. On the transmit side, um, along this vertical wall here is the Mic amplifier, electric microphone, single stage 3904 amplifier, runs through um, providing audio into the SBL1. The output of the SBL1 through this black wire goes into a three stage power amplifier, two stages, which is a 2N222, uh, um, and then the final is a BD139, uh, and that's outputting quite happily 5 watts into a 50 ohm load. Uh, prior going to the antenna, I've got a choice here, um, just using these little links here because I didn't have enough room for a for a, um, a rotary switch. We've got a uh, 80 meter uh, low pass filter, a 40 meter, and a 20 meter. Um, transmits just through a simple uh, simple switch there. Yeah, it works really well. So I've got the ability here to tune any frequency I like. Push the button down, I can move the cursor, and then I can jump down to ever I like. So like I say, at the moment it's going from down to 2 to 30 megs. Um, yeah, so at the moment it's, uh, it works really well. I've been um, very happy with it actually. No, no problems at all. It's very sensitive and... Moment. See, yeah, that's, a, that's a local station coming through from New Zealand. Everything like that, so... And, uh, you know, I'm pretty pleased with what they did. Mind you, it'll... <laughs> These things always do, Tony. It was fine-tuned by going slightly down the frequency there. It's only a quarter acre. And, uh, Which is quite helpful. So, yeah, so that's my uh, little tramping radio. Very happy with it. Works really well. Um, hmm. So I think my next project will be a, um, a proper single sideband transceiver. But, uh, like I say... For, this, for the uh, the simplicity of the circuit, it uh, it works remarkably well. Anyway, thanks for watching, and um, hope the next time I upload, it'll be a full-on single sideband transceiver. Thanks so much.